In this video, we're going to see how to use Notepad++ to validate an XML file against an XSD. So first of all, I have an XSD here where I have some user details, first name, last name, Bearcat ID, and favorite shortcut. Each of these is strings, so it's a fairly straightforward XSD file. Next, I have a sample XML file that matches that XSD, or at least I hope so. So first of all, I need to go to the Plugin Manager, and I need to look for a plugin called XML Tools. Let's go ahead and select that and choose Install. And OK. Might as well update the Plugin Manager, so we'll choose Yes, and I'll pause the video as this updates. And it only took a few moments to update the Plugin Manager, so now I choose XML Tools, and we choose Install again. And this time we'll say No. Restart Notepad++ after the install is complete. Now I go ahead and say XML Tools and then Validate Now, and it gives me an error, but part of that is because I'm just using a local XSD file, so I need to change my user details line here just a little bit to indicate that I'm using a local XSD with a no namespace schema location. So I changed my XML like so, and now once again I go to Validate Now, and sure enough we see that the XML is valid. Now, let's say I intentionally make a mistake. Uh, maybe I change the case here on favorite shortcut. Let's watch what happens now. Okay, uh, note that uh, element favorite shortcut is not expected, so it is case sensitive. It's indicating here that an uppercase S is going to cause a problem because that does not match with our schema definition that I've put together over here. So, of course, I want to fix that. Similarly, if I had something like a... Uh, a space, which is not legal, that would fail validation as well. Go ahead and change this. Uh, go ahead and save. And uh, even this notice, even Notepad++ notices that's not legal. So let me just make a new element. We'll call foo, and we'll put bar in the middle, and we'll save. And let's take a look at this. XML tools validate now. And once again, it tells me that foo is not valid because it does not match my schema. So we take that away one more time, save, and then we'll validate, just make sure we're good, and sure enough, we're good. So that's a quick look at how to use Notepad++ in a companion plugin to validate XML against XSD. Thank you.